Center broadcasting live from Hard Slock Stadium in Miami, home of the Kraken. It's a city known for its palm trees, lovely pastel colors, and where adult diapers outsell infant diapers 10 to 1. I love adult diapers. They make going to the movies so much more fun. Why do you think they call it Miami? Old people move and retire so they can start practicing for hell. The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for MFL action. The Los Angeles Volts go up against the Miami Krakens. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim. I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Called a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. Second down and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and ten. And he punched his way out of that tackle. First down. This guy just loves to hit people as hard as he can, Grim. I don't even think he knows what a first down is. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? Second down and ten. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes a rocket. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. He's not just burning down the house, he's taking it to the house.
Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. something going here and it's first and ten and that'll be a first down you know bricks a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league nice to see some old school mano a mano on the turf huh and it's first and ten Target more often. First and four. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Does anyone have a rule book? Because that sounds like he's making stuff up. Uh, do we have a rule book? It's propping up your chair so you can reach the table without spilling your food, idiot. This is a first and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And look at that ref run. He makes it out of bounds to survive another play. <laughs> first down and forever. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. Let me tell you, getting shocked is no joke. I used to wear triple wool socks, slide around on a shed carpet for eight hours so I could shock my younger brother. I went to change the TV channel and got blown across the room into the deer antlers. Second down and we've got to pick up at least half of this. That pass was good for 10 yards. Third down and long. And the quarterback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. <laughs> And it looks like the offense is desperate for a first down. And the defense anticipated a pass there and put an end to the... If you get one more bullshit penalty, you get one more for free. You'll also probably lose the game. Yeah, just do the attack ref dirty trick. And it's first and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. <laughs> 
They're back up here on first down. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. Yeah, they're all in politics, apparently. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Third down and a pussy here. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. The teams are all tied up at the end of quarter one. We'll be right back. And it's first and ten. Second down in a mile. And Briggs, they just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. And I just made up a new name for a sandwich. Third down and the punter is warming up. Falls to the ground. That's incomplete. He needs to throw it when a receiver can catch it. What's he doing? And uh, groundbreaking analysis as always there, Bricks. Well, uh, thank you. I do my part. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he... Oh, what a punishing hit that was. That's how you I remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. That run is good for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, he just got crushed. First and ten. Picks up two yards on the pass. And this guy's six feet tall. He could just have fallen over and gotten two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. First and ten. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Second down and two. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. Ghost <laughs> And that'll bring up third down and seven. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important.
Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. And it's first and ten. It's a zap attack. It's like when you shuffle your... And he fumbles it, Bricks. That was a screwed up play if I ever saw one. And he scores! Pay close attention, kids. You'll see his steps are making a perfect pentagram. Some of your own demons at home. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And he picks up four on that pass and catch. Timeouts aren't just for offense, Grim? Well, they usually are, but sometimes the defense thinks they're helping out in their own special way. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now and is going to try it. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. He is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. And it's first and ten. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. And that'll be their final timeout. Second and three. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. 
The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Great play by the defense results in an interception. Man, what a hit that was. And it's first and ten. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. and downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. First down and one. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. See that boot, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it because I'm too fast. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, man. You know, they train those things to eat only visiting players, but when they're hungry, they'll eat anything. Yeah, sometimes I eat my toenails. And it's first and ten. And he runs it for four yards. Second down and six. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Picks up maybe four on that play. Second 
Second down and six. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And it's first and ten. That's a nice catch for five yards. Second down and five. Nice. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Just a great run for a touchdown. And it's all fun and games until he tries break dancing. Yep, but Skelton's it's always more literal. Don't make any mistakes here. Or they'll Shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Second down in a very lot. Hot one, hot two, hot eight. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. First down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot Second down in a lot. And that's an incomplete pass. Looks like the defense got away with that one there. Uh, I didn't want to grab the receiver like that. He could get hurt. Third down and, well, hot, good luck. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste. Oh, great throw. Great catch. And that puts six points. Now these penalties have really gotten since their face. Go to dirty tricks and hit the dead ref. It feels good.
third down and never get... And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Third down in the offense, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And like every one of my barbecues, this guy's on fire. Does he like original or extra crispy? Now it looks like extra crispy. Oh, good run. He nearly broke it open, Bricks. Yeah, I nearly blew through. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. Well, tell our viewers what you would do, Bricks. Ah! That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in fantasy. Man. And it's first and ten. I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a man. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down in a very lot. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third down and long. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. I ate a piece of licorice once and got a shot like that. It wasn't licorice, you ate it. It was the frayed cords of the leaf blower. Well, it was a red cord and it looked like licorice. The point is... Ah, I forgot my point. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot
Second down and a lot. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have. Several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh, wow, he got mugged. More like a mafia hit. Second down and two. Hot one, hot two, hot two. He is rolling thunder and devastating hit knocks the ball loose. And he's off to the races. He's hit the 40, the 30. He's hit the 20, the 10. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a donut guy than a speed thing, Grim. He's running from his team. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? they just be called sick. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Run. Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be back after I top off my drink. Grab me a scotch while you're up. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stupsing time. That's why the girls... Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. And that'll be the offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grin. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Hot two. Hot three. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors. Hot. And we need money more than they do. Hot two. Hot. Looks like a pass. And it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face and his crotch. I want to see if he cries or pisses himself first. <laughs> Second down. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First and eight to go. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! And they line up for the extra point. It's good. Yeah. 
Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. <laughs> Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck, which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw the real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Hey man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The onside kick is a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a position. Stealing ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. And it's first and ten. The quarterback pass the receiver explodes, and everyone on both sidelines looks very angry. Well, he owed him a lot of money from what I hear, Tim. Like a lot. How much? Yeah, 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 yeah. First down and forever. And this guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about 10 on that play. Crackens lose on their home turf. Rich, is there anything that could be more disappointing to a Diami fan? I don't know. Ever get a soggy hot dog bun with your hot dog? Soggy bun? That makes me sad. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. Yeah, that was beautiful. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.